instructional right now, so... Okay. Rebecca, you're going to document this. All right, so to set the pressure, first you have to remove this cap from here, as we've done. And you use an Allen wrench to loosen this bolt. Well, the bolt you do just a regular wrench, and then oh, just a regular. Allen wrench you stick in there. To tighten it, you screw it down clockwise. To, to untighten it, you screw it counterclockwise. Untightening means lowering the pressure to as low as 500 psi, and if you tighten it down, it goes up to 3,000 psi about. So that's the pressure relief. Great. And you can observe the pressure gauge right here, uh, which the tractor has to be on, but you press the lever, of course, the third lever there, press it, and it will make the valve show what you've got. And without a hose attached to it, that means it's the pressure butts out there so yeah the valve will read the full pressure that it's that it's set for so this will avoid the snapped couplers but then again the issue on the wheel motors will probably have to go to spline the shaft on the motor itself which we don't have right now what are the couplers exactly? what are the couplers yes couplers are these things the tube inside yeah the tube it's, it slips over the shaft and it connects to the to the wheel shaft here, so that's on the pressure relief. 